Welcome guys, it's been a long time since I recorded something like this. Uh, I've been doing farming but quietly. Uh, for those of, of my friends that have been watching me through the journey, uh, as you can see this is 2024, uh, battle of my corn. Uh, that's a pumpkin right there and then that is, is a guy in Kenya. Uh, it's part of the traditional vegetable down there. And then this is corn. Uh, my corn is doing good this year. Um, uh, we thank God for the rains. Uh, we didn't have to get irrigate, which is very important. Um, I'm very thankful this year, especially with what I'm seeing. Uh, my corn looks very, very nice. So as you can see, uh, when I came here to the farm, it was very windy, very windy. Um, here, usually in United States, sometimes during this time of the year, uh, we have rains and we have a lot of heavy winds. As you can also see, I have some beans down here. And then the corn here are kind of very tall. Uh, it's a different kind of a seed. I'm hoping to see if uh, it's gonna produce some corn. It's really tall at this point. It shouldn't be like this, but we'll see. Um, the good thing is we still have a long summer, so I think everything should be fine with them. Also, there's these tomatoes over here. Uh, these are the big round tomatoes. And then we have some um, murare. <laughs> I'm not sure what is the English name. And then kunde. And then isaka mo. Uh, this is the the brown or red stick kind of uh, saga. It's not the one we have two types. I think the other one is as a a dark skin stick but this one has got like a red twig so um, there's two different types but this one seems to do well here in United States then down here some kale uh, fresh kale and then uh, my cabbages didn't do well this year so I'm gonna figure out what to do better next year and then more tomatoes you know, this is what we we love adding every each and every food you cook. We love adding tomatoes, so I always don't miss to grow this. So this is a lot of tomatoes, and then a little bit of uh, more over there, and then a little bit of sujan, hot red pepper right there. Thank you guys, um, if you are new to this channel, please continue subscribing so I can continue updating you guys about what's going on on my farm. Uh, cheers, subscribe and share to your friends. Thank you so much.